<laughs> hello. Hi. Welcome. Hello, we have hello. another official Behemoth stream with Alien Hominid Invasion. A game by the Behemoth that isn't ready yet. No. But we have learned a lot of things because we had a beta. Yes. You gave us the gift this season of beta. Yeah. We got a lot of people playing and we learned a lot. So we're going to go over some of those things we learned today and some changes that we made. Ian is going to be driving our alien around. Wish me luck. Good luck, Ian. <laughs> I already see one of the new enemies on the map. On the Mapuchan. We also have some other things that are new. So... Why don't we, uh... Which way should I go? Well, the the thing with the heart has our new guy. Okay, okay. And then you could go and cut it right to the hideout if you want to turn in. That's... that's a, oh, yes. I see. Okay, yeah. I, yeah that's we have what to I'm go thinking. To, I want to go to there, yes. For anybody who's not seen this... Oh, hang on. Thanks, normal human earth pig. Let's go! It's like candy falling from the sky. <laughs> Alien candy. Delicious. <laughs> Delicious candy. The hazardous spinners. <gasps> so okay. for anybody who's never played Alien Hominid Invasion, which would be understandable since the game's not out yet, you have to... You have to go around and kill agents and gain intel. And I think I left debug on where no agents will spawn. Oh no! Can we put our overlay over top for one moment, please? Please. <laughs> I was like, this is weird. <laughs> Mist there we go, there it is. Go for it, do the magic. Yeah, AI. Okay. There we go. The magic is done. All right, I, so the I agents the show up, and then you get your intel from killing agents. Once you have enough intel, you will you will fax it to the mothership, which is above the, the, the planet, above the city quadrant that you're in. You can roll, and if you hold roll, you'll dig. If you jump and hit roll, you'll dive, which is one of the things that we learned. People who reported having the most fun in Alien Hominid Invasion, no! they would dive the most. So when you're in the air and you hit roll, do that because apparently you have more fun when you do that. That's right. And when you roll, you can't be hit by things. So you can roll through beams that might kill you because lots of people get killed by the beam. There it is. That's the beam that kills everyone. So you can look at that. Ian's showing off. He's just rolling right through it. Oh, wow! I, I need these. Okay, thank you. Up we go. Someone's asking if you can cancel the roll with any kind of movement. Yes, oh. you can. If you have another jump handy, or if you down shoot, you can cancel that. Hello. Give me your intel, please. Also, if, you, if you're holding it, then you'll dig into the ground, but you'll also knock people away through your trajectory. If you just Up. do a regular dive, you don't knock anybody away. Okay. And you can hold <laughs> your attack, and it will do a charge shot. There we shot. go. Oh, yeah. And you also have a mutation. You start as the invader mutation, because you're an invader. That's fitting. And the invader gets to throw grenades. So at the bottom of our brand new HUD Almost that follows the player, you can see 
Oh, then there now we go. the mutation is ready. You get mutation choose by killing things. And then you see the little blue dots. Those are the more mutation juice that you can have. But one of the things people would say is sometimes they would lose themselves in the chaos. And now that the HUD moves with your alien, that has significantly decreased any of that. Purple suits. Purple suits. Take out the purple suits. Oh. They're not actually wearing purple. The mothership has, has uh, done something with our eyes to see our targets. So they don't even know they're marked. They're just doing their thing. Ta-da! Yet again, more lunch money and loot. The loot is, you could, if you noticed, it has a little lock on it. We have to get somewhere safe to open it up. Otherwise, if we die, that's it for us. I can't have that. I'm faced with a decision, Dan. What do I stay? Where do I go? Uh, well, uh, I did see a heart on the map on the next one. Okay, that's... If you pause, do we see that? I don't know if we see that. Yeah, we do. So up, there's that coin, but it's blocking the little heart. You could just go there, so you could risk it. That's what I'm thinking. Oh, as in get out? No, you oh. can risk it by staying if you want, because there's another heart. <laughs> There's a heart that's coming up later, so it's up to you. Okay. That's one of the things. Do you go for the bonus? As the enemies get harder and harder, because the longer you're in the level, the more cr crazy things get? Or do you play it safe? It's up to you as an invader. As long as you've done your objectives, you get to pick. Thank you. Oops. Another thing people were saying is the run speed of the alien they wished it was a little faster. So, one thing we did is give the alien momentum. So if you are running in one direction and you keep holding in that direction, we assume that you would like to go faster and your alien does go a little bit faster. But really, the key here is diving and riding on people's shoulders and digging. All the other abilities make you move faster than the run. However, there is a speed demon mutation in case you're still wanting more. And oh, now, oh, 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 Ian has done it. I wasn't he talking because I was the city really block. stressed out. That's okay. <laughs> he was very focused and he did it. He cleared the city block. And now, now he has another choice to make. Do you stay and make all the money? Oh gosh, or, I keep hitting this. Oh no, you're at zero. Uh, oh. Don't worry, there's more lives to this invader. Oh my gosh. But just, right, right. just as we planned, there's a heart waiting for Ian on the, the next level. I'm it's out here. like it never happened. A you very calculated that. choice. Did I just die on the back? <laughs> well, you made right. 613 lunch money, which is great. And four loot. This is your best score. It shows you that this is your best score. It might be your first score, but it will keep track of whether it's your best. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Just taking a breath here, everyone. The game is a little difficult. Thanks, large lad. Whoa, hey, you found a box of loot. Want what's inside? We'll open it at our hideout. Okay, well, I see the hideout. It's got the kid with the little orange boxes right there we will go there but first all right we must see one of the new things which we're calling the inchworm i don't know if that will be the ultimate name but it's called the inchworm okay what will it be it's already here oh no And there's another new thing. That child is trying to sell you a munition. That, that's something I that love this. <laughs> <laughs> Can we just do this for the next uh, 45 <laughs> minutes? <laughs> that's something I need to change. But it's still kind of fun. All right. So the way the inchworm works is it will bounce off of the sides and the floor and the top of the screen. Kind of like your old Windows screensavers. 
and it causes trouble. Oh, look, there's two more. Oh, this is... <laughs> Oh well, that's interesting because it's supposed to only cap it two, but Ian has gotten lucky and found four. <laughs> <laughs> they can be killed. What can I say? <laughs> I'm playing the lottery today. Oh, oh that's a cool little Yeah, the, the child wants to sell you a weapon. It is better than what you have. It, what does it cost? It costs... <laughs> it costs... It costs... 400, grab it! Okay, okay. Do it! Oh my gosh. It's just the Y button, I believe. Thank there you. There we go. Ian has a better blaster now. Now Ian will do even better. Does that automatically equip you with that? Yeah. Sweet. The interims cannot be thrown. They cannot be done. Nothing can be done to them other than if you murder them. They yeah. don't even have a death animation. That's how brand oh. new they are. Oh, look at this. Ah. Bombard oh, and Inchworms. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Alien <laughs> Hominid, everyone. If you haven't known, Alien Hominid back in the day, the original one, was quite difficult. You will find ah. that ah. the new one can be difficult at times. But Ian has done it. He's run the gamut. I don't even know what just happened. That was like... Uh, that was like <laughs> Squid Games. I don't know. <laughs> Someone's asking, can you make sure that your health bar stays in one place and options? Yeah, we're considering that actually. Because um, that's how it used to be. So it'll be up to you. I think we'll have some options that'll uh, help you customize things. One of the other things we changed was the compass is more towards the center of the screen. So when you have an objective, it'll be closer. That way, you, it won't be on the outside. It'll be more in your range of vision. We're trying to do make changes to make a lot of the information be more where your eyeball is. Because your eyeball, even though it sees everything, it's not really letting your human brain know. So we're putting it in the center so your human brain reacts. Um, what else is there? Oh, you can change the difficulty now. Uh, so if things become too easy or difficult for you, you can adjust the difficulty back in your oh my gosh. profile selection. Yeah, get away from those things. I'm true. <laughs> they don't really let right, you get away from go. them, though. I think what's happening oh, here is we have two variants of the inchworm, but an, uh, there's only one that's active right now. And so it's giving you four of the same, whereas it, eventually this will be a little bit more interesting when we have two of a different kind that show up. But that'll be for another stream. You can also see that the HUD is blinking oh. and let oh. Oh, oh, I thought it was Bombard again. I thought you're really gonna have something happening there. No, nope, just shields. Just everything's just, shielded just, now. Just, just, just take out the shield generators, I'm you know, it's just that easy. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! No! Uh, You've got this. Uh, You've got it. I haven't done the, we haven't done work on their sound yet too, by Wait. the way. Yes, Rich is, oh. Th ah. There we go. Okay, that's what I needed. I feel much better now. Okay. I haven't looked at the chat. I don't know what. <laughs> the maximum, so the game, the game's difficulty kind of goes up as you progress through the city, but it also goes up based on how much time you're spending in a level. And I have raised the difficulty cap of that because some people in the beta have decided that they're going to More live heights. in a level for 10 plus hours. So it now gets much harder on the high end. But the game on the, on the beginning end is about the same, pretty much about the I'm same. I'm going bye-bye. Bye-bye. But there have been a, a lot of tweaks here and there. So that was pretty exciting. Welcome, Inchworm, to Alien Hominid Invasion. <laughs> <laughs> Not quite level two, as I was fighting for my life, and I didn't even break a million, so everyone make fun of me. That's fine. As uh. you... That can't be right. There's no way that's right. Um, so as play. you level up, you gain security clearance to new weapons. Wow. So you can... You can get different weapons that'll appear in your loot as you level up. How do you level up? By 
by invading. Everything you do in Invasion will get you somewhere on um, a better security clearance with the Mothership. You have to show the Mothership that you are capable of wielding the crazy stuff. We also have a new enemy that I of hope appears. Uh, the other thing that the game's doing is as you level up, it looks at how much XP your characters made for themselves. I don't know what you want. I don't even know if we call it XP, but you know what I mean. We all play video games. And more enemy types unlock as you go. So as Ian's going through his run, you'll start to see more enemies appear. Toilet fountain. There we go. Oh. Ice cream delivered. Ice cream delivery. This seems like an unsanitary <laughs> uh, ice cream delivery, but you know what? Sometimes that's just how it goes. <laughs> you know, like in I kind of want to go through that pipe. Aaron, right? I want to go through that pipe. <laughs> uh, okay. We've hold also... Go ahead. Oh, no, I was just telling the agent to hold my grenade. Um, oh, nothing. here, just, hold this for this me. I was just talking to... Uh, <laughs> nothing actually uh, educational for me. <laughs> Maybe it's a bad call, right, Aaron. I next? don't know. I just wanted to go through the pipe. It might not be a good idea. Um, well, some of the objectives have been oh. adjusted. Oh, here's a good one. We have the digesters coming out to Come play. Come on, kids. Get them. As you open more digester cages, more digesters will come out and start jumping out on everybody. Digesters <laughs> are from... <laughs> Did you he, was on, he was on the bot. That's yeah. Great. He can even jump on your shoulders. Get the other uh, ones. Yeah. We got to get all three boxes. All right. Let's get going. I got a minute. Chaos. This is the last oh. one. Oh, nope. off the diving board. Oh my Shoot gosh. it off the diving board. <laughs> oh, no. It's in a, it's in a difficult spot. Okay. We've okay. almost got okay. it. Oh. Really? oh, no, it's up there. <laughs> Get it. Oh. Yes. They're released. They are adorable. I'm just going to say, because I never really talk about voice stuff, I did this for that. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's, that's you. That's me. I'm, I'm playing with baby <laughs> versions. Quite the change <laughs> from Yosef to Digester. <laughs> Um, so let's see, what else do I have here? Some of the hazards have been altered, like there's put the, if anyone's known the poison gas canisters, those are a little different. We have a new enemy that's a swarm, but also a kind of a hazard that's coming up. Um, we've seen the kits that sell you a weapon, that's pretty great. I can tell you some beta data here. Beta data? Yeah. Beta data is always kind of neat. Let's see. The average number of levels that a player goes through before failing is 2.2. .2. So that means that most people fail by the end of the second level. So Ian's actually doing quite well for himself here. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what I'm thinking. I'm just kind of going with the flow. Yeah. Oh, I got to protect this guy. In the grand scheme of things, that means that 88.36% of all levels are successful. All right, out of here. But that also Wait, means riches. that only 38% of players actually defeat the headquarters at the top. So you really got to try. You got to set up your, your invader the way that uh, works best for you. When we get to the hideout, Ian's going to be able to adjust his character as he sees fit with what he's got. And that's one of the great parts of the game that we're about to see. Okay. I I'm love that graffiti. Great job, Patrick. That's some wonderful graffiti. Okay. You okay. can play this game up to four <laughs> players, by the way. You can play four players online or offline. So 
if things get real crazy, you can always have another invader jump in. Are you getting that money? Is that what's going on? I don't know. All right, I'm going to I'm Here. Here, <laughs> hey, hey, here. Parting get. Oh, I'm out of grenades. Never mind. <laughs> There was one thing from beta that was a little crazy. Anybody who's in the know knows that life steal was a little, a little bit much. Just, a, just, just a, like it's a one of those things where I'm like, smidge. I'll get to it. It's fine. <laughs> and then we give you guys the beta, and you fully exploited it. And I have to thank you all for doing that, so I could get lots of information. <laughs> yeah, good job, everyone. <laughs> yeah. Alright, what do we got here? Here we are. What Jump dude. height and damage, damage and revenge damage, but negative health. Oh, that one's just a flat damage increase. That's not bad. It's a crit chance. So from here, Ian can mark things as favorites with the X button, or he can sell things with the Y button. That's a favorite. Uh, we don't need, yeah, we don't need this. Oh, selling the damage. Yeah, I mean, we have a little... Well, I guess that brings... That one gives you negative health. Very... Very daring. Are you saying... Mm -hmm. I'm not sure. It's up to you. That's the great thing about this game. It's it's up to you on what you... <laughs> well, let's go... Uh, I'll toss this swap in. Let's get a boost. Let's see. The average player rolls 29.97 times. That pretty much just means 30 from the planet that I'm from. Um, so you so 30 rolls, but 53 dives. So people are jumping and diving a lot more than they are rolling along the ground. So Dan, what would you go with here? Uh, I kind of just like, well, what's the first one say? Jump height. Same and damage. Deal. That's not bad. What's the burger? What's the burger tell us? Defense on kill. I'd probably go with that one. Okay. Because you kill stuff all the time. 15% damage re received less isn't bad. But we have to change the pigment, don't we? Oh. What do we got? Oh. It Actually no. looks more bun. <laughs> yeah, it's just now the burger's gross. Now it's... <laughs> No, it's blue. This is uh yeah, it's like one of the one of the one of the entrees from that scene in Hook when they're eating like imaginary food. I think people asked me for this helmet for four months. And here it is. So there you go. Burgers. I would be alone. I mean I got I I'm surprised I didn't uh I didn't just pick I love cheeseburgers. I'll just So you we have seven hundred and sixty six money. Why don't we restock that one all Let's the way it. on the left and see if it's anything? Come on, restocking be something great. Three bucks, no whammies. Wait, you didn't re-roll it. Did I not? Hmm? Oh, well, that's interesting. Oh, it re-rolled the stuff on the right. We're gonna have to look at that. <laughs> you used all your money. I think I spammed it, so it doesn't matter anyways. All right, we found something. Okay. Back to the streets. Back to the streets. We're going somewhere neat. We're going up to get that mothership coin and there's more inchworms up ahead. <laughs> I saw more inchworms. That's spooky. But now Ian has a shotgun. And you know, that should that should get the job done. Yes. I have to reload. It will take their skin. It will take their skin. There's like the skin. You've taken it. Hooray. We didn't have gore at first, but everyone kept telling me how they needed skinless. Uh, they needed this. So now there it is. You can also turn it off if it's disgusting you. There is a gore option. So don't you worry. They'll just kind of fall over like funny little clowns if you have gore off. Take that, funny little clowns. 
down. Oh, God. <laughs> A job well done. Wow. So clean. Oh. The active uh, defense that you're receiving when you kill someone is on the HUD on the bottom left. And I'm not sure what was that damage on coin gain? Is that what you had on another one? Can you pause real quick? Yes. Damage on coin gain, 10%. Okay. Got it. Gift of the burger. Gift of the burger. This stream brought to you by uh, In and Out. <laughs> now serving get, blue burger. <laughs> you gotta get in and out of the levels. See, the compass is more towards the center now, so now there's no missing it. It's right there. I might make it a little less splashy now that it's right there, actually. But you'll never miss it. Bye bye, fax machine. What shall you bring? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Is this an. Is this. Who's it gonna. Oh, uh -oh. it's the Megabot. They're testing out the Megabot on us. I'm Megabot going. has had some changes. I should probably. But nothing that Ian can't handle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. If I, <laughs> I haven't hit her once. <laughs> oh but my. When, when you do hit her, it's going to hit so hard because you have that shotgun. There we go. See? There you go. Just do that. Like, I don't know how many more times that is. <laughs> yeah! It's that thing, too. Like, Don't worry. It's going to be okay. Yeah. It's going to be okay. Oh, Jesus. Okay. Okay, I'm just, I'm just centering myself here. That's right. The that's, general the, is, that's another way to do it is you The general is, you is pleased. And yeah. If they get you with their with their um, test run of their boss, they'll be happy about it and they'll take it back to HQ knowing that they did a great job. But, um, yeah. If they if they don't get you, then you kind of beat it up a little bit and then they say, uh-oh, we need to work on this thing. And they bring it back to HQ. So either way, it goes back to HQ. We'll get Megabot next time. Yeah, I need a rematch. That was, uh, that was yeah. unfortunate. We weren't ready. We weren't ready for that. It's not fair. Bruh. Oh, deliver the bomb. You've done it. Bomb deliver. There's a fishbowl that you must deliver as well, and we changed that to make you a little bit slower because fishbowls are heavy. There's a lot of water in them. Well, aquariums are, I guess. And then we have our, uh, our helicopter objective, which now drops bombs. So I'm kind of excited to see that one. Luck of the draw, though, we haven't seen it yet. Some of the, some of the things I've been wanting to show off haven't shown themselves just yet. But we've added that much more stuff that it's harder to get to it, I guess. That's the that's the nature of randomization. We have a bonus up next as well after this. Oh, oh, bonus level has replaced the inchworms. That's pretty good, actually. Okay. Mothership coins are on this level. You use mothership coins for great stuff. You can unlock specific weapons or give yourself an advantage on your next run. You can also make your next run harder. It's up to you on how you want to spend your mothership coins, but here's where we can get them. Oh, 
Oh, there's there's the guy I was just talking about. He used to not do anything. Now he fires. He fires back. Yeah. <laughs> it's different now. But Ian's got this. He's got his shotgun. Oh, get the exclamation mark. Oh. I guess Ian can Ian can throw more grenades now because he has his mutation regen. Can you throw one for us so we can see the mutation regen? Here, here we go, one for you. There, it's going up on its own. One for you. Maybe I should make that even crazier. I worry about the implications of what happens if I do. I'll do. I'll push it a little more. I'm gonna make a note of that. Someone's asking what the exclamation pickup does, and it makes you fire faster. It m gives you more range. It gives you more crit chance. Did and I it miss gives it? you more reload speed. So you can spam it up. That's right. Just chilling. I like how they jump on your back. <laughs> it's a nice little addition. Let's he's throwing. He's, he's throwing off. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't like them. Get off. <laughs> All right, yeah, shield guy won't put up with that stuff. Hold that. Thank you. Digester moments. Yes, that green bar. I got is out of there the danger meter. before I embarrassed myself because I knew. Oh, is that a mothership coin? I think it is. Bring it home for prizes and hollow hugs, says mothership. And then you say, she, okay. She does know best. Okay. All right. Dan, what is this? This is a bonus level. You can die in these, so you just do as good as you can and see how much bonus you make. It's a, it's kind of a little break from yeah. being worried about something bad happening. And you, so yeah, so you don't lose lives, correct? That's right. The lives here don't exist. Okay, okay, okay. You're okay. at zero. This is bad, uh, okay. Oh yeah, remember, I um, just want to point out that Dan asked me to play because I am not as good as him. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to give if a you bad had impression. It, if you hadn't noticed. Oh, hey, it's the new Uzi guys. The new Uzi guys fire weighted balls that slow you down if they hit you. They don't really do that much damage. And then you have to roll or jump or dig to get rid of them. Or you'll be oh. slowed. Oh, the inchworms are still here. They've decided that they, they live here. And so they, they refuse to be overwritten by the bonus level. That's kind of exciting. Thankfully, there's only one of them. Okay, never mind. Now there's two. They also bounce off each other as well as the sides of the screen. I should have mentioned that. So they can make kind of distracting patterns. But all Ian has to do is kill enough people and the wave is clear. And then wave two oh. begins and the and the goodies stack up. More and more goodies. Oh, oh, thanks. oh, oh that thanks. was rude. Oh my gosh. Oh, what a rude move by the shield guy. Pushing us into the uh, the vertical laser. Now we have flamethrower guys too. But Ian can't be stopped by that. Ian's digging. Ian's running for his life. <laughs> Ian is having an easy time. Okay. 
There we hey. go. Okay. Get now we just gotta ice deliver cream. this ice cream. I mean, here's the thing. If I don't deliver this, the next wave won't start, right? That's true. All right, I'm gonna go take lunch. I'll be back. <laughs> As I go and here. grab another person to play, and then... Okay. Hello, large lad. There you go. I'm still working on this. I actually have something, but I didn't implement it, so now I just look bad. But don't you worry. Next time, you'll see the finished stuff there. Get away, inchworm. So I think it's a thing now. You just got to kind of... It's that tank. You gotta just find your zen. If you don't find your zen, they'll find you. So my goal was just to make it to wave two, just just so everything else <laughs> is uh, extra. Everything's yeah, cherry on top. Well, it is a bonus. How much bonus will you make? The highest round that people can get to is five. And I don't think I've seen anyone get to five. But today, here on the stream, <laughs> I will Ian go for will break five the record. as I r race for my life from the inchworms. Oop. Oh. It's like being chased by like dragons. Yeah. Yeah, they're kind of terrifying. An army of dragons with a, like a French bulldog face. Oh, there we go. Wait, why is he purple? Why was he purple? Huh. Aaron, look at the purple one. Look at the purple one. <laughs> there, I threw him. Thank you. Get out of here, purple. <laughs> yeah, he's not supposed to be purple. What's going on there? Oh! <laughs> Aaron says, I see him. He is wrong. <laughs> you are wrong. Okay, time to deliver ice cream, because that's my job. Okay. Reload. Pick up some riches. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Perfect. 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 Thank you. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Thank you. Oh! It's crazy that everything's going so perfect. Okay, Mr. Big Shield. Oh, he's still alive, I though. grenaded him from behind. And he's still okay. Uh-oh! Our bonus is complete. We've done it. Ah! Uh. We've completed our bonus. That was supposed to happen. <laughs> Nobody's supposed to make it through there very, very well. Oh gosh. I just realized by doing this I've just put myself on display and no no see no, everyone no. and be You like have to remember the average player wouldn't have even made it to this part. Well I've seen other people play now, Dan, and <laughs> I got and I got I got a little news for you. The yeah. average player is pretty darn good these days. Well right. we've seen some we've seen a lot of our high score players with their videos. Um well, let's see. But yeah, the ceiling, the, the difficulty ceiling is raised, and Ian nope. is reaching it soon. Um, Stakes have been raised. One thing people used to like to do is hang out by the power-up kid and keep grabbing power-ups, which, you know, he's supposed to have them sometimes, but he he's uh, he's got a longer cooldown on those now. You can't just kind of chill next to power-up kid anymore. Uh, what else did we do? Let's see. I mean, I made a lot of changes, but I'm trying to find the super fun ones. The most, uh, let's see, what's the most used? Speed Demon was the most popular mutation, followed by Vampire, the broken thing, and the Weapon Specialist. That's what people chose the most. Lifesteal was the most chosen boost, which I've actually, I can't remember if I fully removed it or just kind of brought it way down. 
and put the life steal. I think I, I think I got rid of it, uh, at least for boosts. But I think it can be still tied to a weapon. And then the other thing I did was make it so you can now heal more if you roll through a bullet if you have the boost for it. So in order to get that life back, you need to dodge through things that can kill you. It's made it a lot more exciting to heal. So some people will be happy to hear that. Most people were advocating for changes there. Um, some people might not like that, but that's what happened. Uh, which is great because there's a medic mutation and it's put a lot more importance on the medic mutation. So now you bring your buddy with you and he, they can be a healer for the whole group or you can even just bring it for yourself. Nope. But, but yeah, we've been trying to push things to kind of bring more cooperation. Because this is, a, in the end of the day, this is a cooperative game, but you can play it alone. We've tuned it a lot for people who play alone. In fact, we've tuned it probably more for people who play alone, making sure that's perfect. And then from there, when you add your buddies in, it's kind of natural flow. It sort of just works. Oh, there it is. It's up there. Do you, you feel want me to drop it? The yeah, I was I just trying you, to. You don't think you can drop it? You can get. Take hit. me up there. Thank you. There we go. This. It has a health bar, guys. So don't worry. If it gets hit, hey, it's Dan okay. Dan, why can't I get this heart? Oh, because you're maxed on hearts. That's something new in Alien Hominid Invasion. Ah. You can save that for later, as long as you stay on the level. Wow. I, I maxed out hearts, I'm doing something right. That's right, Ian's full lives. He is full lives on normal difficulty. We lowered that by one, by the way. I used oh, to be able to have you. another one. This video game will be available on Steam. It will be available on Xbox, and it will be available on Switch. We do not currently have a release date, but if you follow us on our Steam page, you can get news, or you can wishlist us on Steam. Even if you're not gonna get it on Steam, maybe you're gonna get it on Switch or oh. Xbox, well, you can just wishlist or follow there for super easy info. It'll email you when there's, uh, well, I guess when you wishlist, it'll email you once it's available. Or you just follow along with us as we as we go through our development journey. I did want to tell you guys though that uh, one of the big things we learned going through beta is that people enjoy the game. That was one of the things I hadn't <laughs> mentioned yet. People are pretty happy uh, with what, what they've played. So that's great news because that means that uh, we don't have as much work to do on the game as if you guys reported not having fun. I just got that heart. And S Ian just picked up the heart, yeah. so now he's full again on lives. He, he maximized, he My maximized heart is full. everything to get the most lunch money. But yes, f since we've learned so much from the beta, we found out that uh, we're getting there. We've done the majority of our work on the game. We just have more, some more to do. And we don't know how long that'll be because it's never a good idea. Oh, hey. Okay. Hey, Big Crab. Where would you like me? Oh, big yeah, crab. we haven't done Big Crabs. Yeah. Let's look at Big Crab. Okay. Um, I'm uh, might want a quicker weapon for Big yeah. Crab. Oh, Photon might get the job done. Or yeah, I love, the pho I love the sound of the Photon. Photon so is satisfying. It's an old power-up from the yesteryear version. Oldie but goodie. Okay, everyone, the big crab's coming. Unfortunately, the inchworm is there, too. <laughs> the big crab is a new swarm. And also, there's common armor for the enemies. Ian's got his work cut out for him. Let's see where the big crabs are. They haven't shown themselves yet. Here, big crab, big crab, big crab, big crab. Here, big crab. 
There, oh, he is. there they are. Oh. You can ride on them. Quick, oh. Ian. Hitch a ride on the big crab. I will get right on that. <laughs> At my earliest. There's just. There we go. There you go. Yeah! This is the life. Oh. Oh, there we go. Another one. So big crabs will jump around. They'll try to jump in front of you and then spray this stuff up into the air. It's kind of a, in a way, it's kind of a unique thing because you can stay low and try to pass them and roll right through them. Or you have to go up and around. Oh. You can also try to hitch a ride on the big crab as we did there, but it's... It's actually kind of hard to hitch right on the big crab because he's firing. Yeah, they're like little movable fountains. Yeah, fountains of death. Fountains of frog. Fountains death. of sweet death. And yes, I'm aware they're probably more like a frog because they jump. But you know, I didn't. I didn't name them, even though I did. I'm the agents named them. Oh. Uh, don't worry. All we have to do is get those purple guys in the sea of green. It's like it's like the Hulk's wardrobe up in here. It's all just purple and all green. Right. <laughs> Get him! That's the mini mech. You can kill the agent and commandeer their mini mechs and use them against them. Just as Ian is doing. That's right. Wow, they seem to be kind of beefy up in this wall outside their fortress. Just got to get two more of those purple boys, and we're good to go. One and oh, I you see cracked you. you cracked that tube. That's cool. There we go. I've never seen that tube crack. Oh yeah, I noticed that. There's That's some shards great. and stuff, right? Pretty cool. Uh-oh. Our health is low. It's okay. I have lives. Oh, that you actually look kind of delicious like that. <laughs> look at him. Up. Oh. Okay. You know, someone's asking what the green stuff is made of, and, I t and then I've thought about this, and I still don't know. All I know is it's something that's designed specifically to take out aliens, because they seem to be able to swim in the stuff. So it's got to be something that reacts to whatever DNA we are. We'll learn more about the alien and where they come from and all these other things because there is a story in this game and it continues the story from the previous in some ways some people say well that's a sequel and you're almost right but no kind of you can argue that with yourselves I'll just light the match and leave the room <laughs> yeah but there's gonna be a story that you can follow along and you can find out what happens in this story. That's right. Got We've uh. got the sewer children. We got the agents. We got the mothership. We have the aliens. Uh oh. The that was an embarrassing death by a proximity mine. Let's get out of here. Yeah. We must get to boss. And now uh. it's time to take what on that? the headquarters. <laughs> Our sole purpose for being in this quadrant of the city. Here we go. Boppy, 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 bop. To the bop. ball. Okay. So, the general thinks he can defeat us, does he? Is your setup how you want? Okay, let's, let's, let's think about this. You might want to change the, the head. Here we go. No burgers? Yeah, well, we need, do we have any robot damage? It's defense on kill. What you reckon, Dan? What's the last one give you? Nothing? Is that your just starter? Base, yeah. Defense on kill as well. I say go for that one. 
Because you need to jump around and you get a damage boost. I need guidance. And yeah, we, we probably want crit chance. Yeah. Because you're firing a lot of shots. Okay. And what's our other color choice? That one will will stand out more. We haven't found any pallets. Oh, they well we did though. They were at the store. Yeah, I screwed up and uh, restocked. We found an issue. Yeah, because I'm a professional. Here we here we go. Okay. It is time. It is time to take on Megabot round two. I feel fight. much better about this. Yeah. Well, now we know where we're getting ourselves into. We don't get surprised on the streets. Now we are prepared. He's at me. Yeah, he doesn't laugh at Ian. He's doing his best. <laughs> it is incredibly green in here. The aggression of the enemies is already so high. You can see on the upper right the danger meter. Ian has pushed the danger almost to the maximum. But he doesn't care. He always does this. This because is how he lives. He's just pushing it to the edge. Yeah. What, <laughs> what do we say to death, Dad? <laughs> Not today! Let's go dolphin my way. Oh. Here we go. It's gonna be nope. fine. It's gonna be fine. Oh, hey! Hey! hey. Much preach. To the high ground. Won't even need it, though. Won't even need that extra life. So, Megavod, it comes to this. Last time I had a shotgun, this time <laughs> I have a photon. If she could just if she could just get into your range and get hit, it'd be appreciated. She's oh, I got some electrobots. though. Electrobots, where are those? Are you talking about the these guys? Oh, I see them. Back there. Buddies. Oh, landing of grenade. Those are kind of. It's kind of hard to do. I find. Yeah. If you bounce it off yourself, you bounce it off her onto yourself. That's how you ensure that it will go off. Megabot's kind of good at thwarting grenades, but not against Ian. Uh oh. Uh -oh. She's, She's reached. Mad. She's reached one of her final forms here. Okay. That's fine. It's just like hopscotch, or not hopscotch, it's like jump rope. Bye bye. The farther away you get, the harder it is to dodge. But not for Ian. Not for Ian. He's got her under half health. Ah. 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 All right. Okay. Okay. Let's try this again. Uh-oh. She timed that one way too well. Yes. Hey, guys. Oh, look it. It's a little flybot. Uh, whoa! Uh, it's a little Sorry, factory uh, where they make the flybots. <laughs> hey! Beams. Now you're like a matador. Hey! Uh-oh. We're getting low. Uh, I don't like it. It's cool. I got lives. Head on. Yeah. Megabot as voiced by Monica Franco. That's right. She did a great job. Oh, no. This can't be. How about be. this? Oh, you used your spawn attack. Super secret <laughs> spawn attack. You can spawn on the boss to hurt them. And now, Ian will be defeating Megabot. Here we go, shortly, super secret shortly. spawn attack. Now we got it, okay. Boom! Another easy victory. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Yes, that's so skillful. Quirn. Mission complete. So with the beta, we've only shown a fragment of all of our, these like fun cinematics. We have a lot of cool stuff in store. Um.
you were talking about cinematics earlier, but I was busy trying to stay alive. That's okay. Um, so I just want to mention that there's a lot of fun stuff people haven't seen yet. That's right. There is something that happens, but I can't say anything about it. However, who's that? Thanks, Turtle. I want to thank everybody for playing beta, the people who've played solo, the people who've played multiplayer, and all the feedback that people have given. We are much closer to our target now because of all the information we got. So I want to thank everybody who came by to play. Um, let's look at our let's look at our run stats here. Let's you know, just click through that, and there we go. Total. They only got you ten Puppy times, pie. but you got them four hundred and fifty-eight times. That's not bad at all. Four hundred and fifty-eight. So, That's and we got, uh, we got fourteen loot. One of them got left on the floor, and I don't know when that happened. I missed it too. If anybody knows when that was, let us know. Um, Twenty-two objectives completed. And I don't think we even saw all the kinds of objectives, unfortunately. But we're adding more objectives. People were mentioning they wanted more. We have more. We have other level types that are coming up that were almost ready, but weren't quite ready for the stream. We will be showing those and more on our next stream. And we'll let you guys know when it's coming up. So yeah, just come visit us in Discord. Come see us. Um, Wishlist us on Steam or follow us on Steam, please, or just follow us on our socials. Come to our tw uh, Twitter, you know, do the whole thing <laughs> and let us know what you think. All right. Yeah. Thanks to the team as well for helping us prep with this. We had to make a little qu quick fixes at the end, so thank you. Thank yes. you, all the composers, sound and sound, uh, Patrick Katani, Kansas Libidu, um, uh, I'm forgetting people. I'm forgetting people. It's okay. I want everybody Fernando. to have a good holiday <laughs> and a happy new year. Happy new year, yeah, everyone. Happy Almost. Holidays. Almost. Oh, hey. It's Manuel. What's up, man? Happy new year, almost. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody. <laughs> we'll talk to you soon.